I'm Logan Summit, and this is your L.A. Dodgers Minute. Last Thursday marked the four-week point of the 2024 MLB season, meaning there is another 22 weeks to grind at in the regular season alone. That being said, the Dodgers are currently in first place in the NL West with a not-too-shabby 19-12 start this year. The Dodgers spent a little bit of that do re mi fa sol la ti do in the offseason and made some moves to help put together one of the best all-around offensive teams they have seen in recent years. A case can be made that Otani is worth his massive $700 million contract as just a hitter will not be pitching this season after a September elbow surgery. But he can hit the ball, and hit the ball he has, as he leads the lead in doubles, extra bases, and total bases. Being surrounded by this much talent around the plate has taken some of the pressure off their man behind the plate, Will Smith. In years past, Will has been made to be the man with what Dave Roberts refers to as a total team offense Will can let some of that run production fall on the players around him. And with the likes of Andy Pages and the Hernandez brothers, no relation. Kiki and Teo stepping up to get the ball in play and avoid striking out, this has made the difference early on this year. One area the Dodgers bats can focus on improving is bringing home those runners with the bases loaded. They can do themselves a favor and be a little bit more patient wait for their pitch. Remember kids, the pitcher is the one in trouble with the bases loaded. Contact is king, and the Dodgers have the talent to play the two-strike game. While the bats have been banging, the Dodgers pitching has been, well, interesting. It was no secret the Dodgers needed to pick up multiple starters this offseason, and it appears that Tyler Glass now is the crew's ace. While Yamamoto struggles to find his footing this side of the West Coast pond, Even though Tyler did get knocked around in one of his starts, he has continued to pitch deep into the game, and with a 2.92 ERA, he's playing well. On the other side of that coin, we have Yamamoto. It sure feels like his transition to the show has been a bit of a disappointment thus far. But that may be because he gave up five runs in the very first inning of his first outing. But he has battled back and had three scoreless starts. The good news for the Dodgers is that they are in first place and have the talent on the offensive side of the game to let Yamamoto and the rest of the pitching staff find that groove. Baseball is a long season, and that's before we even get to October. So let's get excited, Dodgers fans. Let's go, L.A. Dodgers. I'm Logan Summit, and this has been your L.A. Dodgers Minute.